welcome to OASIS, Oversized Access State Interstate System User Tutorial Videos. This video will guide you through the steps for setting up an account to order permits using OASIS. The new users of OASIS can create their company account on the login page. You must have an account to order a permit. To create a new account, click the Create One link at the top of the page. The Create New Company Account screen will be displayed. Select the appropriate answer from the Do You Have a Valid USDOT Number drop-down list. Selecting I Have a USDOT Number will allow a company to order permits as well as self-issue qualifying permits. Selecting I am a permit service and will not be issuing permits in my company name designates a permit service to apply for and issue permits on behalf of a trucking company. However, a company that utilizes a permit service must have a valid USDOT number to allow self-issue as well. Selecting I will be issuing permits in my individual name but do not have a USDOT number will allow an individual to apply for a permit. Selecting government agency will allow users to create an account for a state, local, or federal government agency. The user will not enter a USDOT number. Permits for the agencies will not be self-issued. For this example, I will select I have a USDOT number. The field for USDOT number will be displayed. This number will be validated, so it must be associated to the company and entered correctly. Enter the USDOT number and click Validate Numbers to create a company account. Click Clear to return to the drop-down list or click Cancel to return to the login page. Click Validate Numbers to set up the company. A verification window will be displayed if the USDOT number was found. Verify that the company name and address are correct. If the company name and address are not correct, check the USDOT number for accuracy. If the information is correct, click OK on the confirmation message and click Create Account on the Create New Company Account screen. The Create New Company Account Company Information screen will be displayed. If the company's mailing address is the same as the physical address, click the Same as Physical link next to the mailing address heading to pre-populate the fields. Select the primary delivery method. The primary delivery method is how permits will be delivered when ordered. This will be your default delivery method. During the order process, the delivery method can be changed for any permit. Please note that web means that you will access your permits from the company dashboard when you log in to OASIS. Complete all known information in all required fields, including the username and password. The login information will allow you to log in to OASIS. Please note the password requirements. Passwords must be at least eight characters in length, contain at least one lower and one uppercase letter, and at least one number. Click the Submit button once all information has been entered. The Create New Company Account Terminal screen will be displayed. Note that terminals are used if a company has multiple yard or terminal locations. This information is helpful when reporting on the permit activity and being able to tell which terminal ordered which permits. Click New to add a terminal location. Complete all fields for this terminal information. Click the Insert button to save new terminal information or click the Cancel button to exit the terminal information and return to the company information screen without saving. Continue adding new terminal locations by clicking the New button each time until complete. Click the Next Page button when finished adding new terminals to continue to the Create New Company Account Users screen. The Create New Company Account Users screen will be displayed. This screen will show the user who set up this company account displayed in the drop-down list. Click the Edit button to review and complete the original user information. The user who set this account up is defaulted to a user type of supervisor. A supervisor user for a company can see and edit all company information and company users' information. A company user that has a user type of user can only edit their information. All company users can order permits. Complete the user information fields, including the prompt question and response. Without this information, the system cannot assist you if you forget your password. 
Click the Next Page button when finished setting up all users to continue to the Create New Company Account Vehicle screen. The Create New Company Account Vehicle screen will be displayed. You can add vehicles to your inventory to recall during the permit ordering process. You can add your vehicles now or at a later time. Enter the vehicle information. Click Insert to save the vehicle information entered. Click Cancel to exit. Continue adding vehicles by clicking New each time until complete. Once all information has been entered into the system, click the Go to Login Now button to be routed to the login page. The OASIS login page will be displayed. Log in with the username and password established during company setup. Check the box for Remember Me on this computer to have your computer remember your login information. The System Use Notification screen will be displayed. After reading the System Use Notification, click I Understand and Agree to continue to the company dashboard. And welcome to OASIS. Thanks for watching. This concludes the OASIS user tutorial video on how to create a new company account. Don't forget, more videos are available for your convenience.